in my last video i shared with you guys how i got rid of strawberry skin from this to this i went in step how i do my shaving routine as to simple easy tips and tricks i do during shower time that really really helped me get rid of straw berry skin but today's video i'm doing something quite different and i'll be sharing with you two effective body scrubs that you can make in your kitchen that really help me get rid of strawberry skin i'll show you how to make them how i use them and we are starting this video right now strawberry skin is a tiny little dot that appears on our legs not everybody have this and it's as a result of keratin build up from bacteria um oils and skin protein it just occurs as a result of where a large pores and hair follicles to trap dead skin, oils and bacteria and all what not. So starting with our first scrub is the baking soda scrub. This scrub is super super effective guys. You are just going to need baking soda. not baking powder baking soda there are two different things you want to use baking soda not baking powder so i'll just be pouring the quantity i think will be enough for both legs there's no secret measurement to any of these things and i'm mixing it with warm water so i'm just going to continue to go back into the baking soda go back in with my warm water until i've gotten the right amount and consistency or thickness for both legs taking it in my hands and on a wet leg you want to make sure your leg is wet i'm going to start use gradually scrubbing of the strawberry skin or just scrubbing my legs all together i'm bringing it in a closer view so that you guys can appreciate and see what i'm doing you want to use circular motions just on wet body or wet legs to like be scrubbing everything out up and down do this in your bathroom because it's going to be messy but for the sake of this video just to show you a demo of what i'm doing i'm doing it in the room i'm also extending it to my thighs everywhere you have the strawberry legs some people have it on their hands too wherever you just scrubbing everywhere and get into everything So I just wanted to bring you guys close up so that you see how the baking soda is kind of settling deep into your pores and that is how it's going to get to work and really yield effective results. So I'm keeping this like 15 minutes and this like 15 minutes later and you can see how completely white everything is. It's like it has crystallized, the salt has crystallized and it has really done its work. I'm going to wash this off and come back. So after your shower and after the scrubbing process, you want to make sure you, you, you moisturize your skin. It's very important and it's very key to moisturize your skin when you have strawberry lip. A very good moisturizer I recommend is the Ceraville essay lotion for rough and bumpy skin guys this lotion is life if you have strawberry legs go and buy this lotion and this should be your moisturizer come rain come shine is enriched with ceramides salicylic acid that is going to help to just melt off those um, pore clogging gunk that is causing the strawberry legs you could get this cream on Amazon So for the second scrub, we'll need brown sugar and apple cider vinegar. You want the apple cider with the mother, that is the organic apple cider vinegar. The other ones are synthetic and they are not good for your skin. So moving on, I'm putting some brown sugar in a bowl and I'll be mixing it up with the apple cider vinegar. 
and you want to use brown sugar for this not white sugar baby darling white sugar will not be able to achieve what i'm tr we are trying to do here which you'll see with time so i'm trying to use the apple cider vinegar to extract something called glycolic acid from the brown sugar and it's only brown sugar that has this stuff so again i'm just eyeballing all the quantity you don't have to use a specific or special kind of measurement it just depends on whether it's every part of your body that has strawberry skin or it's just for your legs you know the quantity and the amount to make so i'm just mixing mixing uh, everything to get this perfect consistency that is not too thick and it's not too runny and in the shower just like we use the strawberry um, the baking soda one after shower or in between shower you're just going to take it on the tips of your hands and use circular motion to buff out the dead skin cells the um, strawberry skin the oils the bacteria down seated in the pores you're just going to wait for this to do its work like 15 minutes in the bathroom like i was saying this mixture contains glycolic acid which is found in sugar cups it has tiny molecules that ha gives us the ability to to penetrate deep deep within the skin surface and what this does it melts off all those um oils those dead skin present in the pores and just help dissolve everything to reveal a very very new smooth skin from below also like i said initially from the baking soda one don't forget to moisturize moisturizing is very very important if you have strawberry skin all this scrubbing and taking your shower can really dry out the skin which dry skin is also one of the culprit to strawberry legs some people it may be shaving reasons and some people it's as a result of dry skin so you want to make sure you're moisturizing at all times whether you didn't scrub you could even decide to moisturize during the day when you are up and about your business also stop try stop shaving overall if you have strawberry legs like i said after that um dry skin shaving is the next culprit to having strawberry legs it's Continuous shaving just exposes those pores and darken them more, making the matters more worse than what it was before. Personally, I love to wax. Waxing will help you rip out the hair from the root as opposed to shaving. Shaving just gets rid of hair on the surface of the skin. It doesn't have the ability to go deep. But waxing has the ability to rip out those hair from straight from the root and as it's doing that it will get rid of those blackish thing you see all the dirt the oils the gang that seated down below the skin i also use this wax and set for my underarms and it has greatly helped in the appearance of my underarms my legs i virtually use it everywhere you could think about This body wax you see me using is 100% made from home. It is painless. It's called sugar waxing. It's very popular here on YouTube. But if you are hearing this for the first time, I have a video on my channel that shows you how I do it from beginning to scratch the do's and don'ts. I'll link it up on the screen. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Yemi Abiodun. If this is your first time seeing this face, I make helpful videos every week on body care, skin care, many tips and secrets you'll never see anywhere. Con consider subscribing below for more videos and feel free to check out my channel. I even do makeup tutorials and so many much more. Check out my previous videos and subscribe below for more videos. I upload every week and you want to check me out on instagram when i'm not on youtube i'm on instagram let's be friends i reply to all of my messages visit my website yemiabelton.org.ng and if you